Hari Kunzru's short story, White Tears, tells the haunting tale of two young white men who become obsessed with a blues song they record in a park, leading them on a journey through history, memory, and racial violence. The story is narrated in the third person, following the perspective of one of the men, Seth, who is described as a thin, pale young man with a high forehead and large eyes. Seth is an aspiring recording engineer, while his friend, Carter, comes from a wealthy family and has a passion for vintage audio equipment. The two men share a love for music, but their relationship is marked by a sense of unease and tension, with Seth feeling inferior to Carter and trying to prove himself. One day, while recording ambient sounds in a park, they capture the voice of a black man singing a haunting blues song. They are mesmerized by the recording and spend hours manipulating it in the studio, adding echo and distortion, until it sounds like a vintage recording from the 1920s. They upload it to the internet, pretending it is an old blues record, and soon it goes viral, attracting the attention of collectors and historians. However, things take a dark turn when a mysterious old man contacts them, claiming that the song is not a fake but a lost recording by a little-known blues musician named Charlie Shaw. Seth and Carter become obsessed with finding out more about Shaw and the origins of the song, leading them on a journey through the history of blues music, racial violence, and exploitation. As they delve deeper into the past, they begin to experience strange and terrifying phenomena, such as ghostly apparitions, ominous messages, and a sense of being followed. They become convinced that they have awakened a powerful and malevolent force, and that their actions have unleashed a curse that they cannot escape. The story is a powerful commentary on the legacy of racism and cultural appropriation in American history. Through the character of Charlie Shaw, a fictional musician who represents the countless black artists whose work was stolen, co-opted, and erased by white collectors and record labels, the story exposes the ways in which white supremacy has exploited and silenced black voices. Moreover, the story shows how cultural appropriation can be a form of violence, not only against the people whose cultures are being appropriated, but also against the very art forms themselves. By distorting and manipulating the blues song, Seth and Carter are not only erasing its original meaning and context, but also perpetuating a myth of authenticity and nostalgia that obscures the ongoing struggles and injustices faced by black people. The story also raises important questions about memory, history, and identity. Through its fragmented structure and its use of multiple narrative voices and perspectives, the story challenges the idea of a single, unified history and suggests that the past is always present and constantly being reinterpreted and reimagined. Overall, White Tears is a haunting and thought-provoking story that explores the complex and fraught dynamics of race, culture, and power in contemporary America. With its vivid imagery, lyrical prose, and unsettling atmosphere, it captures the essence of the blues as a genre that expresses the pain, the longing, and the resilience of a people who have been denied their humanity and their dignity.